Next to four on your news channel, we are tracking developing news of a body discovered in the Santa Barbara Harbor this morning. A quick response to a spot fire in the Carpinteria foothills today. We'll have an update. And we'll be live from the Santa Barbara County Fair. The gates to the Santa Maria Fair, Fair Park just swung open a short time ago. And people who live near the Cowboys training camp in Oxnard are not happy about elevated seating where they say people can see into their homes. The news starts in 30 seconds. Good? Sound good? Sh sure, sure. The Santa Barbara County Fair is now officially underway. While local ag students have been here at the fair park since this past weekend, today. Live, up and down the coast, from the beaches to the valleys, your news channel starts right now. Good afternoon and thanks for joining us. I'm Scott Hennessy. And I'm Beth Farnsworth. A disturbing discovery today along Santa Barbara's waterfront. A body was found floating near the boat launch area late this morning. Harbor Patrol confirms the call came in via marine radio from a passing boater of a person needing medical attention. Witnesses tell your news channel they spotted the emergency scene before lunchtime. A crowd of police and paramedics doing CPR on someone. Yellow caution tape was quickly put up. The person was well surrounded. It was unclear if it was a male or female. Medics were not able to resuscitate the person. No word on the person's identity. Santa Barbara police are handling the investigation. A full brush fire response was called out for a small sign of smoke in the Carpinteria foothills today. Carpinteria Summerlin fire crews were first on the scene. The U.S. Forest Service, Montecito, and the Santa Barbara County Fire Department also responded. The call came out about 1230. Winds were light and temperatures were mild. The first spot was about a half an acre. Two fire helicopters were very active in the area, gathering water and making quick drops. Other personnel came in on special wildland engines and backcountry vehicles. The uh, smoke with no active fire, but some active smoke burning from a black area that is near a power pole. Uh, and you also see that the, that the grass is burned, but it's not really taken into the heavier vegetation. And with the rains that we had, the, the humidity or the fuel moisture is very high within these plants, which is a good thing for this time of year because it, it helps slow down, slows down the uh, advancing of fire. The fire was in the foothills behind Carpinteria High School and near the Franklin Trail. No homes were threatened and no one on the trail or at the high school campus needed emergency help. Firefighters remain on the scene at this hour to make sure all the glowing embers are out. Water dropping helicopters.